everybody, Cheaply Chic, welcome back to my channel. Today I would like to share a Dollar Tree haul and I know that it has been quite a while since I've shared one. I have been accumulating these things probably for the last three weeks now. I hate to think that it's been that long, but I think it has because these bags have literally been sitting in the corner of my room and I just really need to get this haul done. So. I am filming this Dollar Tree haul today. Uh, the first thing I want to share though are these laminating sheets that I picked up. Let's see, hopefully the glare is not too bad. That I picked up at Aldi. I uh, posted on my Instagram the other day that Aldi has their laminators back in stock that are $20. This is where I bought my laminator that I use in my planner videos probably last year. So $20 is a great buy. It's a little cheaper than Walmart. They also had these laminating pouch sets. This is a little different than the pouch set that they had last year because I bought that one as well. But this one is a 40 pack. It has 20 letter size laminating pouches that are eight, eight and a half by 11 and then 20 legal size which is 11 by 17. So I just thought that was pretty cool. You get 40 sheets and this thing was $5. Okay, so into the Dollar Tree haul. Everyone across YouTube has been sharing these. I bought them actually a few weeks back. I was super excited to be able to find them in my store. I haven't been able to find all of the different types of organizers, but I was excited for what I did find. So I picked up a few of these drawers. I think I have six of them because I would like to try to use some E6000 and attach them together. We'll see. Yeah, I was pretty satisfied with these. Unfortunately, the only one that I opened, can get sticky so I'm really hoping that they're not all that way you guys can let me know in the comments down below if you've had issues but what I notice is the drawer sliders they can get kind of wonky and then the drawer slider can actually there it is getting on video can actually like get jammed with the base itself so that's annoying Hopefully they're not all like that because it can get frustrating. Like you're opening and closing the drawer and it sticks. So I don't know. For a dollar, can you complain too much? Probably not because we all know how much these can be when they're real acrylic. So I'm going to try um, adhering them together and see what I can come up with. But it is a lot of fun that Dollar Tree has these and it makes a great option for a cheaper organization. I also picked up one of the divided organizer with lid. It has three sections and a nice little plastic lid, so I think that's pretty cool. I also picked up a couple of these large organization trays. I love the different sizes of these plastic trays. I use them around my craft room everywhere. They organize my makeup. I use them to organize just all kinds of things. Obviously, these are awesome. I absolutely love that they came out with a larger size, and I picked up two. Now, this is the organizer that I only found one of in my stores. It's the square organizer with lid, and I would actually love to find some more of these. It's just a basic square. I don't know. It's four or five inches across. It can obviously be used for so many different things. And then the last organizer I picked up is this one called Three Compartments Organizer. This would work great in a drawer for different things to keep them separated. I just love it. I love that Dollar Tree has come out with these. I hope that they're not going to be too hard to find and there's something that they carry on a regular basis. I love it when I find LED light bulbs at Dollar Tree. You cannot beat that. I know that these are probably four to five dollars. I've hauled some in the past when I looked them up. They were like four fifty something online. So this is a great deal for an LED light bulb. They last forever. They're just better. <laughs> My husband uses them all over the house. So I was super excited to find them yet again in the Dollar Tree. I also picked up a couple items for the home. I cannot go without these. One of these days I'm going to do a Dollar Tree favorites because I actually have some things like that that I just can't live without. Even some things from the health and beauty section. So one of these days I am going to get to that video. But I absolutely love these. I cannot go without these. I love these heavy duty gloves and the fact that they're only a buck means you can throw them away and you don't feel too guilty about it. And this duster, oh my goodness. I love these and they have them all over the house. I was excited to find the black and silver OPI glittery nail polish. We all know this is a $9 to $10 nail polish. How cool is it that Dollar Tree had some in stock and it's the perfect color for Halloween. So lots of fun there. I was also pretty excited about these that I found. This is called I Love Coconut and Cream 
and it is not a Dollar Tree product. It says made in the UK just for you by I Love Cosmetics Limited. This is a shower gel. It says that it's an exfoliating shower smoothie. It must have some like exfoliating beads in there, but pretty excited to find this and try it. I also found this one in mango and papaya. And then they also had a few moisturizing lotion. This one is raspberry and blackberry. I also picked one up in blueberry and smoothie. And then this is a body butter in strawberries and milkshake. Very strawberry, sugary scented. It's a really nice body butter. I already tried this because I bought some for my girls also. They did have these varieties, the mango, the blueberry, the raspberry, the strawberry, and the coconut like in all varieties of products, whether it was the body cream, the lotion, or the shower gel. So I thought those were a super fun find. If you see these, this is a fantastic deal. We looked them up on Amazon and they varied anywhere from $4 to $12 for the body butter. So that's awesome. These would be a great thing to make a set and give away for Christmas. And what a great deal. And no one even knows they came from the Dollar Tree. So that's awesome. One of the things that I am loving that will be in my favorites video, you guys, this eye makeup remover. I bought a bottle the first time I saw it. I've used it up and I bought three more. I know everyone's different. Everyone's skin is different. Everyone's eyes are different. So what works for me might not work for you. But this eye makeup remover to me is awesome. It doesn't sting if it gets in my eyes. It's not too oily that I can't put makeup on afterward. I love this. I love it just as much as any other eye makeup remover I would get from the drugstore and it's a buck. I just can't live without this now. I'm going to stock up and I'm going to make sure that if they don't carry it anymore, I have some because I love this. A few items in the Halloween section. Well, this isn't exactly Halloween, but for fall, I picked up this pumpkin pie candle. I have not tried this one before. I love the blueberry. Some of the other candles, like the cranberry, I had high hopes for and it didn't really have a nice throw. I'm hoping the pumpkin does a little better. You guys let me know in the comments down below if you had any luck with this pumpkin pie candle. And I also picked up a package of these two pumpkin votive holders. A couple more crafty items out of the Halloween section. I picked up some of these, they're calling them tinsel stems. They're like pipe cleaners. You get 45 in a package. And I also picked up a package of these glitter foam jack-o'-lanterns. You get 10 of them. Five of them are glittery, five of them are not. Moving on to the crafty items, I was excited to find these coloring sticky notes in my store. I had hauled the notepads a little while back. This is by Crown Jewels. And I also picked up this one in a paisley print. A couple more Crown Jewels items I was excited to find in Dollar Tree. They had a whole new box of six different styles of these notepads. I think I took a picture. I'll put it at the end of this video so you guys can see it. But I picked up this notepad because I absolutely love birds and this is so cute. I also picked up this notepad that says Sweet Life and it has the little birds on there. And then I found this notepad by the Jot brand that has the little coffee cup. Love it. I picked up another package of these heart stickers. I go through these. I love these. They're very pretty. They're great quality. You get eight of them for a buck. And then I know that I did find these stickers about three weeks ago. How cute are these glittery owl stickers? I love them. You get 19 in a package. I also picked up a couple of these fruit stickers. You get 40. I picked up one sheet with the flower print. There are 21 in a pack. And then I also picked up a couple of the hearts. I think these will be adorable around Valentine's Day and you get 19 in a package. I also picked up this sticky notepad. It says you rock and then it has the really pretty watercolor page flags. And then some items in the Christmas section. Yes, I am picking up items out of the Christmas section already. I learned my lesson last year and that is if you leave it sit, you won't find it. I also learned that when it comes to these stickers and these snowflakes and things, you need to get them when you can because I went back in last year to pick up some things that I really wanted for some of my projects and they never came back. So this time I tried to think ahead and plan ahead and buy as much as I would need for the season. Hopefully I picked up enough. If not, well, I'm sure I can come up with some other creative idea for things. But these snowflake stickers, they are my 
favorite stickers from the Dollar Tree around Christmas. I love them. This comes in various sizes. You get 25 in a package. I also picked up a few packages of these various stickers. I love the reindeer and the Christmas tree. This one has the snowmen and the bows. And then this one is bows and trees and snowflakes. Another thing I love are these snowflakes from Dollar Tree. Oh my goodness. These are another thing that I bought what I thought was plenty and they never came back. So I was excited and I definitely picked them up this time around. You get 12 of them in a package. This one comes with six glittery and six plain white foam sheets. And then this one is six glittery white snowflakes with six plain ones. I also picked up a 10 pack of these glittery snowflakes that are ornaments, but again, I use them for crafts. And I also picked up this package in the iridescent. I also picked up a five pack of these ornaments. I thought these were really pretty. You get five of them and it says Merry Christmas. I also picked up a five pack of these poinsettias. I think those are so cute and they'll look awesome on some projects. I also picked up a package of these two count light up icicles. They actually come with batteries that you can put in the top and it doesn't illuminate the whole thing. I've actually opened one and looked at it, but it does have an LED glow, which I think is fun. I picked up a couple packages of this confetti type holly stuff. It has some leaves, some holly berries, and then some glittery pieces like snow here in the back. I also picked one up with the blue and white snowflakes and the gold and silver stars. These are great for shaker cards and all kinds of projects. I picked up a package of these stickers, these little snowflake stickers. They're a plastic with a blue finish. And then I also picked up a couple more ornaments. These are the metal stars with the bell. I think those are really cute. I also picked up the silver star with the blue bell. And that is it for my Dollar Tree haul today, you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Hopefully next week I'll be getting back into the swing of things and I can be on camera and all that stuff. But I hope that you enjoyed this video. If you did, please don't forget to give me a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. I have a lot of Dollar Tree things in mind. I have some DIYs on my channel and I also have some that will be coming up in the near future. So keep your eyes open for that. Also, if you would like to follow me over at Instagram, my name is cheaply underscore chic underscore and I would love to talk to you over there. I hope everyone has a great week. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you all next time. Bye!